Good morning, everyone, and welcome to our Gospel Reflection for this Saturday, the 11th of September, as we conclude the 23rd week of Ordinary Time. And so we begin in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our Gospel today comes from Luke, chapter 6, verses 43 to 49. Jesus said to his disciples, There is no sound tree that produces rotten fruit, nor again a rotten tree that produces sound fruit. For every tree can be told by its own fruit. People do not pick figs from thorns, nor gather grapes from brambles. A good man draws what is good from the store of goodness in his heart. A bad man draws what is bad from the store of badness. For a man's words flow out of what fills his heart. Why do you call me Lord, Lord, and not do what I say? Everyone who comes to me and listens to my words and acts on them, I will show you what he is like. He is like the man who, when he built his house, dug and dug deep and laid the foundations on rock. When the river was in flood, it bore down on that house, but could not shake it. It was so well built. But the one who listens and does nothing is like the man who built his house on soil with no foundations. As soon as the river bore down on it, it collapsed. And what a ruin that house became. The Gospel of the Lord. Today, we hear the second of the warnings that Jesus gives as this Sermon on the Plain comes to an end. And in this gospel, there are two images used. The first is the fruit tree and the second is the flood. And we see the whole concept of positive and negative expressed in this gospel. But right in the middle is the key question that we need to focus on. Why do you call me Lord, Lord, and do not do what I say? The question is a sad reflection on the stubbornness of those listening to Jesus. They come and listen, but they do not act. They do not do what Jesus instructs them to do. So for our reflection today, do I let my own stubbornness stop me from doing what Jesus wants? In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thanks for joining me for our Gospel Reflection today. I hope you have a great weekend um, with a bit of luck. Uh, as we celebrate this 10th of September, we might have been let out of lockdown. Um, but I will again look forward to seeing you on Monday. Until then, take care and stay safe. Thanks, everyone. God bless.